hey, hey, yes, yo, I know you're super busy, so let me help you save at least five hours a week on daily SEO checks. Here are 11 things that you can do in under three seconds with the SEO Pro extension. First of all, you can see all the SEO information for a page. You can see the title tag, description if it's available, URL, canonical tag, meta robots, web vitals, an overview of H1 tags, links, images, and also links to sitemap, and robots takes you super fast and super easy. The second thing that you can do with SEO Pro extension is you can export all the page copy in just one click. You can also see the word count and then you can click export page copy here and it will be exported and saved on your device for further analysis. The third thing that you can easily do is to instantly check Cover Vitals metrics for a page. So let's look here. Web Vitals are here, LCP, FAD and CLS. The extension checks Chrome user experience report for mobile and returns results via API. So at first, it checks for field data. So what you see here is the field data, which means that this is the data from real users that is available for this page. If the field data is not available for the page, then the extension checks for the origin data, which is basically the aggregate information about the website. If this is not available, then the extension will show you that there's no information available. In this case, it is available, so you can see what's going on here really easily. The fourth thing that you can do is you can quickly spot any indexing or canonicalization issues. So you can see um, red dots and orange dots here. And if you uh, click on the extension, you can also see that the canonical is different from the URL I'm on. Plus, it has MetaRobot set to no index. You can easily spot any canonicalization things or any MetaRobot things that you want to highlight. The fifth thing that you can do, you can easily analyze the headings hierarchy of any page. So let's go to the main page of Nike. So you can see that there, are, there is one H1 tag, then H2s, fourth, fifth, and then H6 is missing, which is fine. And I can also go to headings and check all the headings here. Or let's say if I go to this page, I can see that it has 14 H1s. And you can see that then it will be highlighted in red, which means that there is some issue with it. And if I want to understand even better what's going on, I can see what tags each H1 have, and I can analyze it even further. The next thing that SEO Pro extension can help you do really quickly is see status code and redirect chains at a glance. So let's say I want to check if they're handling uh, the www website version properly. So I can do this, then first of all, I can see the HTTP status code of this page here. Secondly, I can go to the status tab of the SEO Pro extension and see the red rig chain. So if there are more redirects, you'll see them all here. The next thing that you can do, you can get the number of links per page. If I go to links, I can see the total number, then unique links, and then internal versus external. I can also, see the breakdown of each of them, which is super handy. And I can also export internal links if I want to, let's say, work on internal linking strategy, or I can export all links, including external ones. The next thing that is super easy, you can just click, click highlight nofollow links, and then you will see that all the links are highlighted. All the nofollow links are highlighted here. Then you can just click disable, and then they're not going to be highlighted anymore. The next thing that you can do is spot missing image alt tags. So let's go here and then let's go to the images tab. I can see the total number of images with alt tags and without alt tags. And it's super handy because you can also see the alt tags here and you can easily spot which images are missing alt tags. And then you can open these images and then you can work from there. The tenth thing that you can easily do is that you can see what a page preview will look like when shared on social media. Let's say I want to check open graph. So I go to social and I check the image preview. I check the website that is going to be shown, the title, and then the description of this page. I can also check it here and then see that, for example, for Facebook, there is an image and for Twitter, there is no image. So probably it's going to be a good idea to add the image here as well. And then the last thing that you can easily do, you can check scam, schema markup super easily. So you just go to schema and you can see that there is a product here and then 
I can see the review, rating, all the different parts of this schema. And if there are more schema times, they will be also displayed here. So these were 11 easy things that you can quickly do with the SEO Pro extension. It currently has over 70K users worldwide and people are loving it. So hopefully you are going to be one of the happy users of the SEO Pro extension. Just install it now and I'll be happy to see you in our community.